Have you ever wondered yourself why this dudes had metal spikes on their head? In this video, I will tell you why. The so-called Pickelhaube was initially a purely military and later also police headgear, characterized by its distinctive spike. It was first introduced in Germany in 1843 in the Prussian army and later adopted by other states as well. In 1842, under King Friedrich Wilhelm V of Prussia, a new helmet was prescribed for the Prussian army, which was then introduced in 1843. The first prototype was developed for the cuirassier and was made of steel, featuring eye and neck protection. However, since the helmet was too heavy for the infantry, a new helmet made of pressed buffalo leather with metal fittings was developed. The characteristic feature was the steel metal spike. It was intended to deflect blows from sabers or similar edged weapons. In some regiments, especially in the guard, the spike was replaced by a plume for parade uniforms. In 1844, a ball-tipped spike replaced the previously universally worn spike in the artillery. The ball was considered a symbol of the artillery troops, and it also reduced the risk of artillerymen accidentally injuring each other while handling guns and equipment. In Russia, the spiked helmet was introduced in numerous military units starting from 1846. The Pickelhaube also gained popularity in other European and American countries from the mid-19th century onwards. It is still used for ceremonial purposes today in countries such as Sweden, Chile, or Colombia. If you like this video, please leave a like and subscription. This will help me a lot to grow and develop my content for you guys. So until next time, lads.